I think you're going to like what's up next though. Check this out. Steve Carino doing a promo. What do you think he's talking about? Uh, I'm talking about there too many people now coming into the WWE. They have me working with a guy named Terry Taylor. Terry Taylor, as we know, is the biggest stooge ever in the business, but I got to go ride a bus with him now and then to these different towns. I don't want to do that anymore. Hey, I could have been a baseball announcer. I like the game of baseball. I talked to Tony Schiavone about that, but now they got me with this motherfucker called Terry Taylor. Now they bring in Eric Bischoff. Now they bring in Paul Heyman. And, you know, they even said they wanted to try to bring in Tony Schiavone, but Schiavone said, hey, who's your baseball team? You got a baseball team. I'll come and work for you. And they said, no, we do wrestling on a big level. We don't have a baseball team. So Schiavone said, no, I'll let Steve Carino do it. And uh, uh, the, the guy next to me is, uh, is that Rhino next to me? Yes. Uh, Rhino is dead. No, Just like not. you, Shivani. He's You're not dead. dead. He's not dead. He's not dead. Okay. Never mind what I was saying. He's okay. On, he's on impact. Okay. That's script writers. And that's why we shouldn't have script writers. They said he had died and I'm reading the script right through the teleprompter there that said the guy to my left is dead and he's not dead. He's on impact. So there you go. I don't want to have script writers anymore. And the guy in front of us, does he look like Brian knobs to you? That's Jack, I that's looks Jack like victory. Brian. You know, Jack victory. Yes, it's Jack Victory. Like I said, though, once again, script writers fucking me up. I should not read what script writers say. I should be able to use my own talent and not do that. V for victory. How about oh that? Billy Corgan. How about that? Owner the of the NWA, chilling. Mm hmm. I think I'm going to get, I'm going to think I'm going to get the, uh, the jewel on my forehead. I need you to wear that out on AEW TV. No, I'm not going to do that. I would do it on my live chats on Patreon. Hey, I, I, I'd wear, I, I wear the, I wear it right. And all the guys who log in on Patreon, all right, will log in when they, when they, when the video comes up and I got the jewel on my forehead, they all will go, well, you, what is the chanting supposed to represent? It's uh, it's a cult, and mm. I'm a cult leader. You know what I liked about Justin? What do you like about Justin? He was credible. Tom's a good looking man. Quanda 